If you don't help people to be helpful, they will become harmful. You see, due to selfishness, we see just what we have done, but we don't see whether what we did was able to satisfy or solve a problem. The fact that you were told to sweep a room does not mean that when you pick up a broom, you go in there and then collect few deaths in the room, you are done. Make sure that every corner of the room is made clean. The fact that the broom was sweeping the floor does not mean that you have swept to the satisfaction of the person who asked you to do that. A what person mean? who really wants to serve can never be selfish. And if there is selfishness, there will be a servant. And one thing you need to understand, selfishness can only serve the self and no other person. Because of selfishness, when you ask a person to help you with money, they will tell you they don't have but go and borrow they will tell you i have because of selfishness ask somebody to help you with a food they will tell you we don't have but tell them you are selling your tv set they will collect it and give you money why they have what can satisfy them but they don't have what can help people meaning that everything they give to people they need to have something in return and this is becoming the way of life life will never stop becoming difficult as far as selfishness to rules and mostly what we do is this let people fight for us we will call them heroes let people support us today we will call them kind but let the same person make a mistake even those he helped are the ones who rise against him i always want to tell you this this life is said that without wisdom you will struggle surviving many are committing suicide not because they don't have anything in life but they are afraid of their fellow man's reaction towards their fault and negative things so what can they be in your way? In your mind, why are you not in your way? Now, my nipa does any no, my nipa in your way. The word disgrace is not an act that the person committed which was not right, but it is the attitude of people towards the mistake of that person. That is what is called disgrace, and that attitude is always ill, ill attitude, awkward attitude. We will say foul words against these people because they have made mistakes. Remember, as far as you are prone to make mistakes, anytime you see another person who has gone wayward see yourself in the shoes of the person because it could be you the next time round. so since you see a person or anytime you see a person doing good all the time have it behind your brain and let it be in your head that no matter how good this person is i know he can make mistakes but personally i am ready to overlook their faults and remember what they are doing today because what they have done today or what they are doing today is the reason why many people are surviving and are alive i will be a medium of motivation to such person this life has become so horrible just because of our fellow man and do you know what is so intriguing some people can keep your negative past life in their head yet they don't have any scriptures in their head are these people growing up to become something meaningful that will bless their own children you see in this life when people are kind very good and soft-hearted people who lack wisdom maltreat them when they meet a wicked person they will be praying to god god give me somebody who is kind take me out of this person's neck i always say this the way you are inside will attract the people around you therefore if you have found yourself in the midst of wicked people if what is inside you is done like that the lord will take you away from them but if you have not changed from within those people cannot stay away from you. be very careful of a heart that is not sound more than the wrong people around you because a pure heart will always welcome god but a pure environment does not attract god